Okay, so I just wanted to share something really quick with you. Um, if you're doing your weight painting and um, you run into this issue here where you flooded the area and um, you still have some uh, loose vertices or vertices that are kind of just going wherever they want to go and you're like, wait a minute, what is that doing? You know, I put it to um, a flood of one and then maybe you went and you tried to like um, replace a weight from one to from from one spot um, lessen it to make it smaller if you will and uh, and then the vertice went all wonky on you went somewhere like that um, so it was all weighted then I took and removed the weight from the index one bone um, so that I could add more weight to the index two so that I could smooth out this rotation this joint rotation but then it went all crazy and I was like wait a minute what happened so let me show you real quick it's a little pro tip um, that uh, if you go into um, the split, no, uh, under windows under editor general editors and under your component editor hit component editor and then um, I like to take these things that I'm going to open up and I create like a um, I put them on my um, so there's my component editor there you just hold uh, shift and control and um, left mouse onto the whatever one of the um, menus you want to select I'll just do it again so I hold shift and control and then I hit the left mouse and it puts it there I already have one so I'll get rid of it but I can go here now and I can hit component editor and it opens up on my other window my other screen um, so it's here and um, immediately because I have that vertice selected you can see index one index finger two left left um, but here we are with thumbs why are the thumbs influencing the index I have zeros everywhere except for here and here so both of these are, are not zero so what I'll do is um, let's see I could take and I'll make this smaller move this over to the side oh no no don't take over the whole window don't take over the whole window so move this over to the side and uh, let's see we take and what we want is we want see the most you can have influence is one that's the highest you can have so zero to one is the influence on any vertice um, because there's a seven here a 0.7 here then there's less likely chance that I'm gonna have the full one um, influence between my two index finger bones that I want to have the, the influence of as you can see I only have 0 0.07 here on index finger 2 and 0.23 on index finger 1 and that's because this thumb is eating up some of the influence it's eating up the majority of the influence actually but all it needs is some of it to mess up what I'm trying to do so the easy fix to that is um, just simply zero that out and then boom changes so now between the the two joints that I want to have influence um, they're divide they're divided up into or added together right but divided up and then added together to make that that one um, and then there's another one here which can you see yeah that angle see I was like digging in it looks like it hurts it's stuck in there right so that's this one zero that bad boy out And then boom, easy peasy, came back out of there. Now, um, 
I'm gonna get back to work. I just want to stop by and drop that on you real quick. Quick little pro tip. Um, and yeah, stay tuned. Like, share, and subscribe on the channel. I plan on adding a whole lot more uh, tutorials showing behind the scenes as I create my own universe. And uh, yeah, I hope you uh, enjoy the ride. Thanks.